Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. I got this awesome comment from Jason asking if I could review Palm Beach County, Florida. And of course I can. Now, before I jump in and I review this uh, Palm Beach, I just wanna let you know, if you guys want me to review a specific city, a specific county, a specific state, even a specific house, please ju uh, just go ahead and comment down below and I will jump in and make you that video. Now, um, I wanna uh, jump into some breaking news right now. So basically, interest rates are going through the roof and I wanted to show you that the average, if your mortgage payment that across the United States, right? If you take the median mortgage payment right now is if you take the medium household, uh, the medium sale price of a home, um, now it's over $2,000, right? So it's kind of crazy. Back in, in um, it, it, you know, just a few years ago, it was $900. That's what basically the difference in interest make, right? This is, um, th this blue right here is your principal and this uh, brown right here is what you would be paying in interest rate. So it's kind of insane, right? So check this out. If we look at, if we, if we move out and if we zoom out, check this out. In Texas right now, the Texas area is over now 30,000% uh, the monthly mortgage payment for someone buying a house in the Austin area is now over $3,000. In Miami is over $3,000. In New York is over $3,000. So what is that doing to basically the, account, the housing market? It, it's pricing out a lot of buyers because what's happening is if you were looking to buy a house and now you realize that you know, what you could afford is not what you want, right? The house that you could afford, you know, six months ago you, you can't afford it anymore because you you get priced out, right? If your budget was 500,000 and you could afford it with an interest rate of two and a half, three percent, and now it's up to 6%, then you're pretty screwed and now you can't afford the house anymore. And when you look at what you can afford, you might not like that. You might say, you know, screw it. I don't wanna buy that. I don't, I don't wanna go backwards, I wanna go forwards. So basically a lot of people get priced out and a lot of people say, hey, I'm gonna wait. And that's basically where we are. So we're gonna see prices start to come down faster and faster because we're gonna have eventually less and less buyers. Right now, personally, I would not be buying. I would be waiting. I would be waiting three, six, uh, you know, 12 months, um, two, two years even, as and just to see when the bottom is really gonna hit. Because if we start getting seeing layoffs, you could see the prices are really gonna start to drop. Now, our uh, Jason wants me to review homes uh, 500,000 to seven hundred thousand dollars, and I have a tab right here. I actually had it to a million, but I'll go ahead and change it to seven hundred thousand. And this is basically what we have available. Now, this is a funny-looking um, county because it kind of like it gets really skinny right here, and then it gets really fat over here. But I think if you're gonna live in in Palm Beach County, I, I'm sure you want to live closer to the water over here. There is a nice little downtown. I think there's some buildings here. So let's look and see what we could find. Let's see if we see any price cuts and let's see something that stands out. Look at this beautiful living. This is has a $26,000 price cut, $550,000. Ouch, it's only a one bedroom, almost a thousand square foot, two bedrooms. So it is at a condo, which could be perfect for some people. I mean, imagine waking up to this. Look at these little, uh, like little sand dunes, little mini islands super super cool i mean you could only imagine you know you get your paddle board you come out here you putz around it's actually beautiful living let's see how much the hoa is 600 bucks man that's that's a lot so when you, you when you think about 550 plus adding you know what that costs right now with the mortgage payments you're going to be above 3000 plus uh plus your uh plus what's it called um your uh, taxes property taxes, and now you're looking at a $600 HOA fee. I mean, it got, it does get expensive, but you couldn't ask for a better location. Now, um, yeah, I kind of love it, but again, it's only a thousand square foot, so it's tiny, but you get to live, it's almost like resort living, right? Let's see what else we can find. Now, you guys know that these guys are, you know, prone to hurricanes, unfortunately, and that's something to think about as a, you know, we just had a huge hurricane scare come and uh, it's scary, guys. Now look at this. This is a three, man, this is huge. 3,100 square foot, almost 3,200 square foot, five bedroom, three bath, uh, $660,000. This is a house. It looks like it's on a cul-de-sac. Look, it's got a nice sidewalk 
grass on both sides. This is a nice looking neighborhood. Let's zoom in to see how it looks. Okay, so it is close to the freeway. It is gonna get a little on the loud side, but it's okay because you got this beautiful, beautiful golf course and you get this uh, beautiful lake that you could walk around that you could drown your sorrows of the highway back there. I mean, it honestly, personally, it does not bother me. Um, sometimes the highway sounds like the ocean. Uh, but this looks like an amazing house, like uh, 660. Again, it's a little on the expensive side. Inside, oh, geez, purple doors. What the heck? No way. Okay, so first things first, you paint those doors. There's no way I'm coming home to purple doors. Uh, I don't know. That's just me. So the kitchen looks nice. Um, don't love the tile, but I it's completely moving ready. And you know what? Uh, this is a big house, so I would really not like having to uh, rip up that tile anytime soon, especially if there's no problems with it just because you know doing the floors on a house like this is going to cost you like fifteen twenty thousand dollars and i i think i could wait <laughs> i could definitely wait um but the upstairs has uh like tile uh looks like uh nice floors it's got the wood floors uh but no this house shows really nice bathroom's insane everything's really nice i i don't like you know just quick paint job and you're in and again look at that backyard it's a beautiful beautiful golf course all right so this is 660 i love it love it love it love it let's see what else we can find that's a good find actually here's one uh look this one's actually has a two-car garage has uh double red doors really like that 560 fifteen thousand dollars off you know these guys are motivated when you come inside it's a little on the plain side don't it's not very homey to me um but you know what you could make it your own. This is 2,000 square foot, so it's a perfect size. Four bedroom, three bath. HOA is 170. Not that bad. I like the kitchen. Nah, the kitchen's dated. Needs needs a new kitchen. This house, I would say, you put new floors. You rip up the carpet. You put new floors. You put a new kitchen and may, maybe update one of these bathrooms. I'm, I'm sure they're, yeah, the bathrooms are okay for now, but you update this and you will have yourself a beautiful, beautiful house. Uh, could you could just imagine wood floors, how nice it would, like maybe you could do tile, but do uh, the wood tile, you know what I'm talking about? So that would look insane. So again, this house has a lot of potential. $560,000 is not cheap, but you get a lot of house, four bedroom, three bath. So definitely, uh, you have some options. You could do the resort live, uh, the resort living, you know, close to downtown. Have a have an apartment. You could have your own house. I mean, there's kind of crazy things. What the hell is this? Five hundred and sixty thousand dollars. This is a computer. Uh, this is what you could have. Okay, no thanks. So yeah, there's a lot of options, right? You have some old school Spanish homes. You know, very traditional to the area. Uh, this is a thousand square foot, very expensive, two bedroom, one bath, but I guarantee you this is like probably historic and probably has, uh, you know, very low taxes as a result. This is super nice. Look at this room though. It's This is a tiny house and very, very expensive, but super cute. There's got a lot of character and, uh, you know, 649. So I, I, I think there's a lot of options for your price range. Uh, here's a single story really really nice again different 640 um 2200 square foot not that much character but really really nice very homey again it's next to a golf course sick sick house what's the hoa here 400 a month that does get kind of pricey but look it's awesome i love it love this house so there's a lot of options especially if you love to golf it seems like you're gonna be able to find something really, really nice. Now, jumping over to the Redfern Weekly Housing Market rate uh, data, if we see West Palm Beach, it looks like it, you know, as the interest rates uh, popped, uh, we did see a, uh, a drop, but then there was that, remember that brief period where interest rates went uh, down again? Uh, but now, you know, interest rates are spiking again. So we'll see if this trend continues. I would imagine that it's only going to drop um, and possibly drop below this 2021 level. Again, you know what? Things a few years ago were 285, now they're 443. So uh, it's expensive out there. It really, and prices have really ballooned. If you guys want me to make a video on a specific city, a specific county, specific state, uh, even a, a house, please go ahead, comment down below, and I will jump in and make you that video. If you're new to my channel and you like my videos, please don't forget to smash that subscribe button and go ahead and like and leave a comment. Again, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys, and I'll see you on the next video.